To the case against R. Kelly, tomorrow the trial star witness takes the stand for a second day. That woman, who the entire child pornography case is centered around, telling jurors today she had underage sex with the singer hundreds of times. CBS 2's Tara Molina has that dramatic testimony. She's not using her real name, and you can see her face was not drawn in court. But Jane, taking the stand for the first time, made a pivotal record with her testimony. Now 37, she said her relationship with R. Kelly started at 12 or 13. Introduced by her aunt Stephanie, a musician working with Kelly at the time. Jane, a singer in a group then, said her relationship with Kelly changed within weeks of asking Kelly to become her godfather, helping with her music career becoming sexual. She said it started with phone sex, Kelly asking her about her underwear, turning physical when she was 14. Kelly would give her alcohol. She said it helped loosen her up, describing pornographic videos he would play during this, featuring people she knew, eventually engaging in group sex acts with underage friends. She said Kelly encouraged her to bring around. Testifying the physical relationship continued and she lost her virginity to Kelly at the age of 15. She said she had sex with Kelly an uncountable number of times, hundreds. Many of those acts recorded by Kelly, sex tapes Jane said she wasn't comfortable with. Where were her parents during all of this? Jane said once she told them R. Kelly was her godfather working on her music with her, they were comfortable with her being at his studio. Kelly was married at the time, and Jane said oftentimes her parents thought she was at home with them, not at the studio alone with Kelly. But it didn't stay that way. Later in her testimony, Jane detailed being forced by Kelly to tell her parents about their sexual relationship, claiming he confirmed a sex tape of theirs had been leaked and was about to be public. She said Kelly told her he wanted her parents on his team. Detailing a meeting arranged with Kelly and her parents at an Oak Park hotel, she described her father's response as hysterical, saying she vividly remembers her father telling Kelly, I can't help you. I can't help you. Prosecutors say Jane and her family were pressured and ultimately paid to lie on the record by the singer and his team. Her testimony and cross-examination will start back up first thing tomorrow. This trial expected to run about four weeks. Reporting outside Dirksen Federal Courthouse, I'm Tara Molina, CBS 2 News.